obviously you're familiar with the Steelers having played them so many times. Uh, there are certain things you look for that they do from year to year, regardless of. Um, no, it's funny you ask that. Um, you know, Coach Brick told us on uh, Monday that if you think about the Steelers, it's not the you know Ben Roethlisberger, not the old school Steelers. Cause that's what I'm used to playing as well. So now when I started watching them, it kind of kind of caught me by surprise. You know, you know, I used to seeing all the, the big linemen, all the power, all the counters, you know, all the different run schemes. And they, one of the main things that they still kept is the crunch, uh, which is similar to the power. And they're going to take their shots when they get a chance, but. You know, just think about you know the, the old school still. Just think about Big Ben and those guys. Uh, it's definitely not that type of that type of team anymore. Yeah, after all those years, weird not seeing Ben back there. Yeah, you know. yeah, um, but you get used to it quick, so yeah. <laughs> you got to move on. But um, um, another great opportunity for us. Um, a great AFC opponent, uh, well coached, um, great schemes, great defense. As we know, um, offense has have playmakers and, and they have a good special team as well. So as um, far as going against a good AFC opponent, a good team, uh, it's gonna be another great test for us on the road. Um, I think overemphasize on our communication. Um, you know, we felt like we was doing a good job in practice, communicating, getting getting keys from the offense. Um, but for some reason, it just wasn't carried over in, in the game in a certain spots. Um, you know, third down, and you think about something explosive. So, um, just for this week, I know we just been emphasizing just to each other as players, just talking more on the field. You know, giving more hand signals. And, um, you know, we still have our meetings after after practice and things like that. But really, just focus on our jobs and focus on what we have to do in order for our team to be great. We were just talking to Ulbrich, and he, he kind of said that maybe he simplified it a little bit this week, maybe he scaled down. Yeah, sometimes that's that's what it's about. Um, you always want to try to scheme up the right plays, like you uh, call make calls to be in the right position every time. But uh, sometimes when you get back to your fundamentals, that's all you need. And um, not saying that we just simplify the whole defense, but uh, for the most part, we just pretty much getting back to our basics, um, getting back to th- that we getting back to things that we know we can do well, and, uh, and after that, just react and play ball. I was just going to ask, because you're the signal caller, because mm-hmm. like, you get the play. So does that, I mean, do you change your approach to speak at all? Or like, because it seems like every, everything kind of like yeah. stems from you. Like, not, not really. Um, you know, I get the call, I, I, I give out the call. Um, whether, you know, whether it's, uh, no, no matter what it is, um, my, my weekly my weekly game plan is, is the same. Um, it's, it's my job to communicate with Brick and to, and to my teammates if you feel like it's too much talking or you feel like you can't get in the right spot or it might be a, too many moving parts in the call. That's that's what we figure out during the week. But, but for the most part, you know, we, we stick to a plan. And then if you feel if it's working or if you feel we need to adjust on the sideline, something like that, we'll, we'll make that change. Do the Steelers do a lot of pre-snap motion to try to throw off your communication? Um, so far as the three games that we that we've been in, um, not as much, but they definitely have plays to try to you know figure out what what coverage that we're in. So uh, we just got to make sure that we do a good job of you know showing not showing our pressures, and when we don't have a pressure, showing pressure. So just showing good disguises um, to make up for the quarterback.